Man. Before I can even start <clears throat> this video, I gotta remove my whereabouts off this package. And then we can get it cracking. Yeah, you know I mean, I don't even know what's in here. And by the way, if you guys want to know, this is going to be a sneaker sale video. I got tons of shoes up for sale. Some from the personal collection and also some that um, I feel you guys, they want to take advantage of. I get, I, get, I get hit up in the comments like, yo, or via email. You never have my size, yo. Can you get this size, that size? So what I did is over a course of a few months, I just randomly pick up stuff that I think is affordable so I can, you know, provide it for you guys. Anyways, I think that's it. Now let's get into this video. Man, where do I begin? Oh, I know. Scully on. Got the all feet, man. We got the Justin Timberlake. What's poppin' on with your boyfriend? Get it back in the building. Yo, hold up, hold up, hold up, man. I had a re record this. How? What's poppin' homies, it's your boyfriend Nitty back in the building, back in the sneaker room with all the lights on, all the artificial lights on right now. Right now it is the election day or election day. We should know what the president would be by the time you're watching this video, so I don't know if I'm gonna have time to edit in. But anyways, man, I hope everyone went out there and vote, who choose to, who decided they wanna participate so there could be a voice, a reason. This time it's okay to be a follower, be part of the masses in the sense that go out there and vote and make your vote count. But off that, Right now, I'm gonna talk about sneaker sale. But before I can get into the sneaker sale, cause I got a ton of shoes laid out right now for you guys to see. Um, I'm not sure what the price is gonna be. I'm gonna try to give you guys a ballpark of roughly around what I would charge, but I'm gonna try to remember the size. And before we can get into that, I wanna show you guys my pickup. Now, as I've been mentioning for every video I do with this, this type of setup, I got a ton of boxes over there from, you know, from these guys that I haven't unboxed, man. I was gonna let it pile up and I was gonna do a crazy unboxing towards the end of the year. And I'm like, why? Why, Frank? Why waste your time? So every so often I'll just grab a box and unbox it and see what it is. I don't know what this is. So let's find out together. All right. <clears throat> boom, boom, boom. I'm gonna do the honors. Ooh. I'm gonna try to do less editing as possible. And I'm gonna show you guys all the way through because I don't want people thinking like I'm taping these boxes up. You know what I'm saying? Faking the funk. That ain't, that ain't what this is about. I can see I'm opening it right here for the first time with the Jess Do It Theft Tape. And boom, what do we have? What do we have? Yeah, I see it. It's a Jordan. I'm looking at the camera above. It's a Jordan. But which Jordan, though? Do we know? Do we, do we, do we, do we know? Get that out of here. All right, woo, there you go. Peep the label. These are size 12, my size. And these are, duh, 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 duh. perfect timing, perfect timing. Cause I may have a video right after this that I can shoot. And blah, blah, here we go. These are the Air Jordan 1 Game Royals. What, where are they calling these, bro? Let me find out real quick. Dun, 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 dun. The game Roy Lowe's. I was I was right. I was right. These are the game Royal Lowe's. Not to be confused with the highs. <laughs> obviously, you guys could you guys already know. Now I caught this off the whim. I think I oh, obviously I did caught off the um, Nike Plus app that they released. I don't remember when these dropped, but I know I wanted this pair. I already got the breads. I got a few other pairs I copped this year. I don't think this is one of my doubles, but um, I wanted to have it, you know, just for the collection. Here are Jordan 1 Lowe's, Jordan Jumpman um, on the tongue, Wings logo on the back heel. You got a royal swoosh, both on the medial and lateral side of the shoe. White side panels, black outsole, black laces, white tongue with a white toe box. Did I miss anything? Probably not. Let's get into the meat and potatoes while you guys are here, man. I know you guys want to see what am I offering you guys on outletplug.com. Now, 
If you don't know, outletplug.com is where I throw up all my deals, um, steals, so you guys can purchase. And I have multiple sizes. Majority of the time is 80% my size because the shoes in my collection or shoes I want to have and no longer want. But um, I've been doing some soul searching. I'm like, yo, I can offer you guys opportunity. Just because I can't get a shoe in my size doesn't mean I have to be selfish and not offer it to you guys. So over here, I have accumulated a lot of pair of shoes that um, I've been finding an outlet for over a couple of months and I just want to offer it to you guys, man. So without further ado, let's get into these shoes. Now, this is going to be no particular order. I'm just going to go through them real quick. Now, this is a Nike ID Greek Freaks, all green joint. Um, not sure what I'm going to sell it for. These are size 12, I believe, right? I don't even know. And I also want to mention this because it's a Nike ID. It says best dad inside the tongue. Now, this is not something I created, something I found in the outlet, so I'm offering it to you guys. Oh man, I'm so debating on this, man. This is the Air Jordan 5 Premium. This shoe retail for $400. I'm debating on getting this shoe away. Oh, by the way, that shoe that I showed previously is not coming with a box, and neither are these if I decide to sell them. All black, premium leather, dope. Size 11 and a half for these joints, man. I'm, I'm, I'm still debating, but they could be yours. Ah, for the smaller feet gang, man. These are the Air Jordan, Air Jordan. These are the Air Max 98 all white. They're called pure platinum. Uh, this is gonna be a size nine and a half. Um, I may have a few pairs of these, not too much, just a few. And for the smaller feet gang, man, here you guys go. Air Max 90 Mars joint. What size are these? These are a size four, man. So small feet gang, if you want for your kids, uh, any girls out there that wear GS and that wear size four, these are yours. Air Max 90s, come with extra set of laces. Don't have the box for these as well. And if you're into Jordans and you like collecting Air Jordan ones like your boy, here you go. All black, this is essential player. Um, these dropped like two, three years ago, back in August. I do have the black and the tan joints, but these are the black. And these are the small size, size five and a half, I believe. Oh, size six, size six. I may have another pair size five and a half. I was holding out for my son, but I may offer it to you guys because there's no telling when he's gonna rock this. But anyways, yep, small feet gang. And for all those who still need an Air Max and still need these Volt uh, Klotz Air Max 97s, man, here you go, Volt and gray. Uh, this pair is like a size 10 and a half, I believe. I can't remember, man. Size nine and a half. So if you were a nine and a half, you can get these. One of my favorites, y'all, one of my favorites, Air Max Nike ID. Now this have all the markings of Air Max OG, but it's th theoretically not. Look at the outsole, that does not represent the Air Max. Look at the midfoot, toe, toe box, the swoosh. Yes, but it's a Nike ID, just want, want y'all to be clear. And this is a size eight and a half. Eight and a half, y'all. All these shoes are DS so far. Every shoe I've shown you is DS. Uh, not coming with the box. Another small feet gang joint are these LeBrons, bro. Man, I want this shoe in my size, but this is coming with the box. These are like size seven, right? Yeah, size seven, man. So small feet gang out there if you're looking for these. These are your size seven with a box. DS never been worn. Now we get into some basketball shoes, man. Blah, blah. These are the Paul George fours, I believe. The Gatorade joints, also a shoe I wanted, but I couldn't get it in my size. Um, I believe these are like a 10 or yeah, 10 and a half or so. Yeah, 10 and a half, uh, no box, but they're yours if you want them, if you're looking for that Gatorade theme, Paul George. Here's a shoe that I wanted and I'm debating on keeping. I still may keep but I already have this shoe and I already hoop in this shoe, but I'm holding on for whatever reason, man. These are the KD Kids, the kids. Ah, uh, Volt all the way through the shoe. You already know I love my Volt. Size 12, comes with the box, and I wanted this shoe so, so bad. I had this shoe for so many months. Never put them on my feet to play basketball. Actually got a size smaller, and that's where I hoop in, and I love playing ball in them. These are DS. And I'm just thinking, just holding on to them, man. But I'm like, I'm not gonna play ball in them. I still have a tons of shoes uh, to play basketball in that I have not uh, played in. And I'm already pooping in the 12, a KD 12. So why do I need to have another KD 12? So these may be up for grabs, man. I'm hoping, cause I love these. Oh, and if you guys missed out on the Air Jordan 5 grapes, here you go. Now I copped this shoe to do a review. I thought I was gonna like it. Now this shoe is butter. I love the quality on this shoe, the suede. And, but I don't think I'm a rocket, man. To be to be 100 with y'all, I don't. DS got the box and everything. Um, yeah. So if you guys want this, I believe it's a size 12 as well. That KD I just shown is a size 12, and I already showed you what the Gatorade was, man. So yeah, if you guys are interested or you missed out on the release and you still need a pair, these are gonna be available. Now the next few shoes is gonna be Jordans as well. Here you go. These are the Air Jordan Six denims. Now I already have a pair to be fair. 
Um, up here is right here. Yeah. I uh, customized these, man. They look more like Freddy Krueger than anything. You can still smell the bleach on them. And um, I got a second pair because I wanted somebody who's a little bit more crafty, a little bit more artistic than I am. Uh, but uh, I'm like, uh, am I going to do it? I don't know. I'm debating, but I'm like, yo, somebody buy them. They can have them. Um, like I said, I already got my pair. Maybe I can have somebody redo these. And what I like more about these is the fact that I put the the lace holes in them, multiple color. You see the red and yellow, different laces, and look at the lace tips. So that's the part I like more, most about it. I try to fray them and everything, but this is not about the review of, of these. It's about these joints, man. So if you guys care for them, if I haven't have a change of heart, they're yours. Size 12. Oh man, the next two pairs of shoes is gonna be some Jordans. And you already know these shoes are dear to my heart. I rock a lot of these. They're the Air Jordan 1s, man. Air Jordan 1s. Uh, these are the Zoom joints. I forgot what they actually call them. Start with a T, I believe. Um, the suede on here is crazy. I think these are size 11 and a half because I was, end up getting two pairs. Yeah, these are size 11 and a half. I don't need two pairs of these. Um, don't think this shoe's gonna get that much wear. So I'm like, yo, I'm, 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 I'm just gonna hold on to one. But look at that outsole. The outsole is crazy, man. That's dope. Reflective swoosh, both on the medial and lateral side. You got that funky green. I think it's a dope shoe, man. I think it's a dope shoe. Size 11 and a half as well. But if you don't want those, man, you can always jump on these. Now these are the sat the black satins. A lot of people slept on them, including me. Including me until it went on sale. And I just, you know, um, I think the big homie just hit me up with the pair, man. Uh, size 11 and a half. And then I found these in the outlet. And I help a few of you guys cop them. I cop a few more pairs. Uh, a few more being size. This is size 11 or 12. I think I cop 11 or, and a 12 because I was going to keep a 12 for myself because the one that, that just gave me is 11 and a half. Yeah, this is a 12. So I'm like, yeah, I'm just gonna hold on to the one that the homie give me and just sell the ones that I purchased. Unless I have a change of heart, but more likely you should see this on the site along with a size 11. And I think that's it. I think that's all. If it's not, I just, you know, I'll just surprise y'all. Oh, also one thing, man, I wanna let y'all know what I'm doing too as well. Since it's uh, winter, in a, well, it's winter everywhere, essentially because it's the season. But since it's colder in other cities and states compared to Florida, man, I got a ton of champion sweaters and hoodies on the website I drop them like around march which i feel was still fair it was still cold back then but nobody was going anywhere you know what i'm saying because we were all locked down so what i'm gonna do man to help a lot of people out i'm gonna reduce those prices tremendously and what i'm gonna do is i'm going to sell those sweaters uh roughly around 15 to 20 dollars if you buy a pair of shoes so all you got to do is pick up one pair of these and you can buy any sweater for $15. Now, there's some dope sweaters on there. I think $15 is going to be the price. I got to see. I'm losing money. So it's not even a, a break even. This is like I'm losing. And at the same time, help somebody who may need uh, sweaters in the area and probably like a color but don't want to pay the price I, I'm asking for it. I'm um, just going to offer it to you guys on top of any purchase. So I figure like anyone buy any shoes, go on there, select a, a sweater that you like, put it in the cart. You're still going to have to pay whatever I'm asking for it. Uh, unless I could figure it out. Um, but if you end up paying the price that I'm asking for, I will refund you the difference. So all the sweaters, uh, lo so long you purchase it with a pair of shoes, I'm gonna sell them all of them for $15. Um, do I have a limit on how many sweaters you can buy? Uh, probably so, I wanna be fair to everybody, right? And if you just wanna buy a sweater, um, I'll probably sell the sweater for like maybe $20 to everybody if you don't want to purchase a shoe. But if you purchase a shoe, I'm gonna drop additional $5, man. I hope that makes sense. I hope I can figure that out at the time of sale. But if you're listening to me, if I haven't figured it out where it can just systematically, you buy a shoe, you add a sweater to the cart and then discount it for you. If it doesn't, don't fret, man. Pay whatever is the asking price. So if the sweater's $25 and the shoe's 100, that's $125 plus checkout. I will refund you the difference. Scouts honor. Is that just, I don't know. I don't even know. But anyways, man, that's it. It's a wrap. Just want to show you guys what I got to offer, man. Hope you guys see something you like. If you don't, don't worry. All the funds and proceeds for this video will be supporting more content similar to this. Well, not sales video, but you know, more outlet videos, more talking head videos, etc. man. Also stay tuned. We got the biggest unboxing Jordan one. Well, we already did the biggest unboxing. So we got to change it up. We got the second biggest, no, we're going to classify it the biggest. We got a Jordan 1 collection coming up here shortly. So I hope I can get that done in a month in time. I went for my compadre, the big homie, to come into town and we can just come up with a big scheme and concept to shoot this video, man. So stay tuned to that. And that's it. I'm out of here.
this video's been long-winded. I hope you guys like what you see. Until then, until we meet again, you already know my slogan. Good to go. It's a wrap. 16 minutes. Hopefully I can cut it down to like 15. Gatorade. Man, if you also want to buy 